Welcome to another episode of Hunting with Hathaway. Come along as Old Hathaway takes you on various adventures throughout the Deep South. I got these pretty babies this afternoon. No hunting for me. Let's cook something. Got my coals just right. I'm gonna cook these venison burgers in direct over here. To start off with. You can cook them direct if you want to. I just prefer to cook them indirect. Seems like they stay juicier that way. Put that up there. And then the secret weapon I'm gonna put up here on the top rack. It's gonna be direct. But I'm not putting it right over the coals. I'm putting it up here. Normally I would smoke it a little ahead of time, but I don't have time this afternoon. So let's let it ride for a while. This little rascal's the reason I'm behind. I had to stop and feed her. Just right. Pretty good, Dr. Pepper? Uh-huh. I must daddy. drink me about 15 Dr. Peppers. My my daddy, he buy, he buys them at the door at the store. And them's in the glass bottle, ain't they? Yep, and I like them. All right, it's been about 20 minutes. Let's see what these things are doing. Oh yeah. Swap them around a little bit. Get these towards the front. While that's doing this thing, trying to break out the cast iron man, I gotta do it. Get some green onion and bell peppers in there. Let's get that wheel it down a little bit. All right, about another 10, 15 minutes has went by. Let's check on these onions. Onions and bell peppers. Yeah, they're doing up just right. Them babies is about done. We're about to make magic happen. Oh yeah. All right, we gotta get this bacon off and let it sit over here and cool a little bit. Look at that. Son. Set it over here on the cutting board. We're gonna let it cool because we gotta cut it up just a little bit. Put it in here with these onions and bell peppers. Drop a little bit. Okay. <laughs> Alright, bacon's cooled off enough I can handle it. Let's chop this stuff up. Well, I say I can handle it. It's still burning the fire. Huh? Huh? Alright. All right, our peppers and onions, ready. Time to make it happen. Put our hamburgers in here. We do three at a time. Got to get your tater masher, man. You use what you want. I use a tater masher. Mash up the hamburger. Add the bacon. I just let, let um, Jess eat one, one of the 
Stir that around, jug it a little bit. So it smells fine. Now we gotta get our manwich sauce in there. There's still sauce in these cans. You can't let it go to waste. Now we got it all. Give us a stir. You heat that through and through and it's done. But I like to add a little extra liquid to it. That is what you're smelling. Ooh, and then let it simmer back down till it thickens back up. What we're going to do, you see how hot our coals is burning, we're going to move this in direct over here. Get it out from directly over the coals. You hot son of a Move it over here to the side. Let it simmer, simmer a little bit. Mama Sue's home. Let's look at this. Just right. Got my sim on. Let's get in here and plate this up. How about it? How about it? Woo, baby. Good. Is that any good there, dear killer? <laughs> yum, yum. You can make this dish easily on the stove and probably, well, I'm sure a lot quicker, but you can't do this. You can't stay outside with your kids around the fire and uh, it dang sure ain't going to taste as good as, it's, as it does grilled. But, uh, We'll see y'all on the next one. Hope y'all enjoy. Hope y'all enjoy and, and have a good day. And have a good day every day. And I hope I hope that that you'll you'll meet new friends and and um I hope you'll be fun together. Bye. See y'all. <laughs>